Hey everyone, you know what's crazy? Every single day, millions of tons of rice husks are burned or dumped as waste around the world. Just imagine all that smoke going into our air for nothing. But what if I told you that this elegant, biodegradable plate in my hand was made from that exact waste? And what if I told you, you could be part of this incredible solution? Today, I'm gonna show you something that blew my mind when I first discovered it. How we can transform rice husk waste into beautiful, functional plates and cups that decompose naturally within 90 days. No plastic, no trees cut down, just smart reuse of what already exists. Stick around till the end, because I'll share a shocking fact about traditional disposables that made me completely rethink everything. Trust me, you won't see, see your takeout containers the same way again. So here's the deal, rice is the staple food for over half the world's population. When rice is processed, the outer protective covering, the husk, is removed. For every 1,000 kilograms of rice patty, we get about 200 kilograms of rice husk. Globally, that's around 120 million tons of rice husks generated every year. Most of this ends up burned in open fields, creating massive air pollution or dumped into landfills where it takes up precious space. And get this, when it burns, it releases greenhouse gases that drive climate change. But here's where it gets interesting. Rice husks are naturally rich in silica, about 20% by weight. They're also tough, water resistant, and have natural thermal insulation. While this plastic plate will sit in a landfill for 500 plus years, releasing microplastics into our environment. This rice husk plate, it'll return to the earth in just 90 days. No chemicals, no microplastics, no centuries long waste problem. Let's talk about what makes rice husks so special. That outer layer contains silica, lignin, and cellulose, powerful natural compounds that give rice husks their strength and durability. The process, it starts with cleaning and grinding the husks into a fine powder. Now, I wanna show you something interesting. Notice how the water beads up instead of being absorbed? That's the natural water resistance at work. The same feature that makes our plates and cups perfect for hot and cold foods without leaking or getting soggy. The manufacturing process combines the rice husk powder with a small amount of natural binder. Think of it like a plant-based glue. The mixture is then pressed under heat to create the final shape. The beauty of this process is its versatility. By using different molds, we can create plates, bowls, cups, and even cutlery, all customizable in size and shape. These aren't flimsy alternatives. They're sturdy, heat-resistant up to 140 degrees Celsius, 284 threes, and can hold hot liquids without leaking or transferring heat to your hands. And unlike some paper alternatives, they won't get soggy, even with stews or curries. Now let's talk about the real impact. Every time you choose a rice husk product over plastic, you're one, reducing landfill waste, two, eliminating microplastics, three, converting agricultural waste into a valuable resource, four, saving trees that would be cut for paper products. A single rice husk plate has a carbon footprint 75% smaller than its plastic counterpart. If just 1% of the world's single-use plastics were replaced with rice husk alternatives, we'd prevent over 2.5 million tons of plastic waste every year. I remember when I first learned these numbers, I felt something I hadn't felt in a long time when thinking about environmental problems. Hope, not just abstract hope, but practical, actionable hope. This isn't just theory, it's happening now. Restaurants, events, and even entire communities are switching to rice husk disposables, and the feedback has been incredible. People love using products that don't come with the guilt of environmental harm. Now, I wanna be completely honest with you. These products aren't perfect yet. The current production capacity is still small compared to plastic manufacturing. And while prices have come down significantly, they still cost about 20 to 30% more than conventional plastics, though this gap is closing every year as production scales up. What excites me most is where this technology is heading. Research Researchers are now developing rice husk containers with even better properties, longer shelf life, enhanced durability, and some that can even be microwaved. Here's the shocking truth I promised. The average person throws away around 110 pounds of plastic each year, and every piece of plastic ever made still exists somewhere on our planet. This is why choices matter. This is why innovation matters. And this is why I wanted to share this with you today. In the description below, I've linked to some companies that make these products, as well as resources if you're interested in the manufacturing process and I'd love to hear from you. Have you ever used rice husk products before? Would you consider switching from plastic to these biodegradable alternatives? What other innovative sustainability solutions have caught your attention? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. If you found this interesting, please give the video a thumbs up, share it with someone who might appreciate it, and subscribe for more content on practical sustainability solutions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.